Churchill ako hapa. Nataka tu kwa heshima tumpigie makovi mazuri akuje hapa atusalimie. Tumpigie makovi mazuri. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe tena. Madhani ya Rosho. <laughs> ah. Great. I make it very short. Taiba fupi sana kwa sababu leo ni siku ya kushukuru Mungu kwa sababu ya Gibson Muragi. Let's appreciate God and thank God for Gibson. Kuna jamaa aliandika uh, wak, wakati we posted it akasema mnaenda kufungua duka ya viti na meza nikamwambia twende kutufungua duka ya viti na meza tunaenda kuwa part of a journey a testimony of what god can do to one person to affect thousands of lives and that's why today i'm here i want to celebrate you in a big big way and thank you so much bishop for standing with uh, uh, gibson gibson tulikutana naye vi very miraculously kwa sababu tulikuwa tumeenda mazishi kwa kina Karimbo alafu Karimbo ni comedian tulikuwa naye by Churchill show sasa tukitoka hapo tukaenda Nyeri sasa kuna haka ka jamaa kanashinda na mimi hapa akaniachi tunaenda kula kuku inaitwaje hiyo mahali ya kuku tumus tumus anakaa hapa hataki kuniacha hapo hapa kwani you you've already introduced me to nishakujua unaitwa Gibson eh eh hey, na baya mimi nafanyaga mambo ya furniture ni sawa uliniambia tukiwa huko umeniambia hapa tukatoka hapo tukaenda mahali ingine itwa 019 eh bado wako hapa nisha usini uliniambia unatengeneza kaviti ni sawa tumekaa mpaka usiku wa manane eh mimi ni yule bado unatengeneza kaviti Namwambia ni sawa nasikio niko na usingizi nataka kwenda kulala <laughs> ah, eh, uki, kabla ulale nilikuwa nataka kukuumbusha kwa bado mimi ni ule wa ule Gibson wa viti just in case usahau ni mimi bado huyo huyo nikienda kuingia kwa gari sasa niko na usingizi it's around 3 am eh, eh, teremsha kio eh, ni ule kijana wa wacha tutaonana kesho ni sawa katuangalia tukaenda Guess what? Alijua mahali nalala. Asubuhi. Amefunguliwa gate. Eh, mwambie ni yule kijana. Ni nani? Ni Gibson, ule kijana wa mbao na viti niko hapa. I do know that night alikuwa anataka kunipeleka kwa duka yake. Nikaona nikamwambia tutafanya kesho. Asubuhi he was there. So tukaenda kaka hawa kingine kadogo sana kunywa chai kadogo sana hata mwenyewe hata anijui hata ana tv ana radio hata tukakula maandazi na chai afu tukaenda kwa duka yake so haikuwa duka moja kubwa sana vile alikuwa ananisifia jua hata vile alisema modern pacific nilikuwa nafikiri ni wazungu wameandika na wahindi lakini na what impressed me wakati tuliingia huko ndani huko nyuma kwa workshop nilipata vijana wengi sana wanafanya hiyo mambo ya kutengeneza hizo viti anaonesha wamama au wamama wanatushona sijui nini a lot of young men there alafu kaniambia huyu amemtoa kwa street amemsaidia sasa ni fundi huyu na we natoaga hivi na that touched my heart then akaniambia story yake ya kumaliza shule form 2 kama ambia now what i can give you is only one thing a uh, church show is not on television right now lakini nitakuja nikurecord na niweke kwa youtube and that's where the journey of uh, mr gibson began so i'm so happy that after all those days and all this publicity you got after that you've never stopped believing and dreaming leo nakimbia garden city kuna duka tumefungua inaitwa Panda. Umesikia Panda? Ni wa Chinese. Wako na vitu over 200,000. Kumejaa watu huko ni crisis. Watu wana shop mpaka saa nane usiku. Now, Gibson, I want to tell you this. 
those Chinese are putting over a billion shillings in that one shop. Sasa wewe ile utafanya as you go on and I'm sure bishop atakushikilia mkono ushikane na institutions na watu ambao wanaweza kusaidia ku scale up. Ku scale up ni kusonga mbele. Tusikie kuna Modern Pacific iko Nakuru, iko Kisumu, iko Mombasa na inawezekana Gibson. The only problem we have as Africans shida yetu ni kwa sababu mtu ushikilia kitu moja unashikilia nikikuitisha for example mimi natengeneza mkate for example nikikwambia niletee mikate 100,000 you don't know how to do it so what you do tunafaa kushikana you get like minded people i'm so happy you have banks and partners who are working with you and because you are helping the youth na serikali iko hapa nani wa serikali yako hapa tuongee naye senator wetu amekam asante <laughs> sana now and women rep now people like him sio lazima uwapatie OGW na HSC na whatever introduce him to uh, the relevant institution empower him uh, let him partner with the government afundishe vijana wengine wa Tibet vile kutengeneza viti make him a leader as young as he is that's how we we'll create these jobs we are looking for i've done it on my content creation we can do it with the gibson muraga and let me tell you huyu muraga unamuona hapa unaona muraga huyu is a leader leader sio lazima asimame hapa aongee siasa leader ni matendo na ni action and what you've done god is going to lift you up you're going to grow other muragas and that's what's called legacy may god bless you may god bless modern uh, furniture pacific and my dream and prayer is to see you across africa god bless you Amen. thank you very much asante sana tumpigia makofi mazuri thanks a lot <laughs>